this is the cruelest joke of them all. When you go to a toilet and you lift up the lid and there's no seat. This is a common occurrence around the world. I don't know how people use this. I don't know if you sit on it or you hover or you're supposed to like put your feet on it and perch. I don't know how people poop here, but this lid has absolutely no purpose. This is something completely new. What is this called, Eric? Potaminica. Potaminica? Yes. Ooh, it's really good. Potaminica. It's good? Yeah. yeah. What does it taste like? Like a sweet almond. Sweet almond. Very sweet. Huh. Probably the sweetest nut I've ever had. Okay, let's get some. Yeah. Okay. I, I will never get the name of this down. I think you might need to write it for us. Potaminica. Potaminica. Yes. The shell is very hard. You can't open it with your fingers. It's got like a, a star shape to it. It splits at those seams. So there's a little seed. Little brown seed like that. That was very sweet. It's like a super sweet almond for me. Yeah, it's like an almond. A little more of a chestnut flavor though. And the sweetness is like twice as much as a regular almond. Like almonds are a little sweet, maybe like a one or a two out of ten. This is more like a four. It's got like maybe around the sweetness of an apple or like a sweet chestnut. Oh, it's actually really tasty. Since filming this, I've learned a bit more about Votamenica, including how to say Votamenica, which, by the way, is a Malagasy word that translates to oily seed. These are very rare, and they do not have an English name, but I vote that they get called star nuts. One fun fact about them is besides just being eaten as a snack, they're also used locally to treat parasites in babies. During our trip, this was one of the rarest fruits that we found, but it's also the one that has the most potential for sale in other parts of the world. These look cool, they taste great, they're purportedly healthy, I think they grow easily, and if you market them under my name for them, Starnut, it is basically a guaranteed sell. But if you do, send me a check. This is a local, local jackfruit. For one. Uh, um, I'll get it. Get okay, like five pieces. We have uh, an audience that's been following us <laughs> everywhere. These children <laughs> have been following us the whole way. High five! Yeah. <laughs> uh, Four thousand. Four thousand. Okay, I'll buy it. So here's an edible root that you eat raw. <laughs> Yeah. All right. There's a tree here, and the vine that is in the tree, not the, it looks a little deceiving, because this is a tree with a vine that's kind of like wrapped in it, and that is uh, the fruit right here. This is a different one. You see that's got five, uh, five's wing, five wings to it instead of six, and not really much much of a nut in there, but it is a related, uh, you know, a little bit of like what a related species would look like is this. Neat. And locals are baffled by me and Steven.
Well, I really hope you enjoyed that video, guys. If you did, you may want to check out the video that is below me right now. That should be good, too. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, it is a huge help to my channel, so please do consider subscribing or clicking that bell. That does something, too. Not sure what it is. Also, check out the description below. There's all sorts of other things I have going on. I don't even know anymore. But, guys, I will see you next time. Take care.